is sustainability? Is it only about climate change? No, 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 no. Sustainability is much more. It can only come when we, all of us, really want it. Let's think about this place. It is one of the biggest square in the center of Naples, in Italy. It is called Peblicito Square. In other times, this square is full of people. Let's imagine it, hundreds or thousands of people. What happens if someone else from the top tell them, oblige them to do something they don't want? Perhaps at the start, they will do it. But in the end, riots will come. On the other hand, if these people really want to do something, really decide to do something, riots will not come. And these people will put much more energy in what they are doing. So sustainability can only come when people really deeply want to live in friendship with all the other living parts of this world. And when they really want to live a better place to their children and to the children of their children, so sustainability cannot come from the top. It can only come when it is understood and it is achieved at a local level. Now, we are going to talk about mind. We are going to talk about forest, about plastic, about energy, about housing, about logistics. All these factors have one thing in common, and it is that sustainability can only come when it starts from our own heart. So, enjoy this film and please be sustainable.
Waking up in the morning with a vogue memory of a dream. I made it long ago, still today heats a clear in me. The feeling that my life, I walking backwards, it was rewinding. All this prompted me with curiosity to make sense of it. It said that if you walk backwards, it means wanting to change your way of behind of things or behave. Nothing was the same after the dream. Life itself opens up. It unfolds showing you possibilities that you would never have imagined. Everything around us is permeated with invisible messages that we cannot perceive or recognize because of our lack of attention. Similar people, sooner or later, they meet. Not by chance, but because they are connected on the same frequency. All the well-known psychoanalyst Gustav Jung said, the coincidences link it together instantly. They affect your life and psyche, and here is synchronicity. With a new glance, more careful, we know that in moments of great difficulty, we run into people who have the task of change the course of events, like an impetuous force of nature, creating fundamental bonds for our existence. All that led me to be the man I am today. I almost forgot. My name is Marco Piemonte. I live in Italy and work in the sector of renewable energies. What my life goes on on day read about the Kyoto Agreement. Who would have thought that an international agreement born to combat global warming would have seduced me to the point of revolutioning my existence? My point of view on finance drove an ecological depth that affect everything. I found a close correlation between my professional activity, the environmental sustainability and the ethical contents on the 2030 agenda through the 17 Sustainable Development Goals. After gaining some awareness on an urgent issue such as climate change, in 2017 I created a brand to give foundations to some project I have in mind. Certainly, you have a good spirit of observation and you have noticed that my story focuses on extreme water. Water, for me, is a life. The water is transformed, it's pure, it's energy. There is an enjoyment of spontaneous nature. Every generation, he can live his relationship with Mother Heart, but it's of the human intellect that we come to technology. They change and expand the boundaries of the utopia 
of the Promiser land. Sostenibili is trendy. Perhaps it's arriving in Italy. With a few years of delay and with not entirely clear concept. Let's not get confused. Sustainability is not marketing, but a necessity. It's the voice of parents that starts from the heart to protect the future of their children. The work continues in this direction.